Hey lovelies, it's your girl Swan Create here bringing you a brand new video. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Thanks so much for giving my video a try. I hope you stick around and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button and click that little bell so you'll always be notified when a new video comes out. Hey! So, a while ago, Join With Waffles made a video where she created artist trading cards and I thought that was a really cool idea. So, I had this scrap paper of my Fabrino scrap paper it has some like slight marks and discoloration so I put a I did a drawing and it didn't work out but no matter how much I erase it did not oops <laughs> it wasn't coming off so I found it was a good way to reuse this paper since I'm going to use like color pencil or something else over it so you won't really notice the discoloration kind of slight but you'll see it more in real life so I asked over on Patreon what I should do with it, like what should I draw in it, and they suggested that I should draw my OCs, and I thought that was a cool idea, and also it's a fun way to draw tiny because I'm the type of person who draws big, I'm a big drawing person. So that, I'm going to design like what the card is going to look like, so let's move this aside a little. And open up my sketchbook. And if and you need to get my sketch. Wait a little. And here it is. Alright. So so to start off. I realized this is something she did. She drew like, and by she I mean drawing with waffle, draw like a template of the card. So maybe the class could be here, like what my, oh, let's zoom in a little. Yeah. So it could be like, this is what the class could be. So you know I'm drawing Swan. So with Swan, her class will be, well, let's call it Avatar. And no, not Avatar, the last airbender. What do you spell Avatar? Like, she's my Avatar. And Moonlight is like a kitchen witch, so I'll put kitchen witch on the side. And I want, like, the main to stand out. And then I have a white spot at the bottom, like power 25. <laughs> Alright, so there's the idea for the card. So I think it's going to be a combination of, like, this one and this one. Yeah, just want you to see more of the body. I kind of like we it go have like a peak of the my avatar swan, and then really awesome avatar. <laughs> yeah. So these are the ideas that I have. I'm going to sketch it on the card. So all right, guys, I'm going to take this over to my bed, which is my preferred place to sketch. And I'll get back to you. Okay, lovely. So the first one of my OCs I'm doing is small. Whoa. Can you guys even see that? Right, let's zoom in. Oh, watch how much I have to zoom in. Here. Can this potato? Here. Okay. Good. <laughs> So guys, the first one I'm doing is Swan. You guys know her. You guys love her. She's my avatar. You know the face I draw on everything that I have. So I'm going to get in my color pencils and color her. Yeah.
okay lovely so here's one it was really interesting to paint this more to even draw this more but I find she looks cute and up next you guys know her as well you guys love her and this is moonlight oh I've never colored moonlight in colored pencil before so it's, I might have to use the watercolor for her skin and I'm sure you guys saw me do it in the f in when I was doing Swan, but I use my kneaded eraser, like small pieces, to stick the paper to the table so I won't move it out of frame like I usually do it. So let's see, stick it in frame. I'm only like using two sides. I, it go take a while to come off. You just take piece of the kneaded eraser again and you just roll it on and you're good to go. I love kneaded eraser. It's so multi-versatile. Okay lovelies, so here's Moonlight. Her skin is way darker than I'm used to but I'm actually liking it. In contrast with her hair, I'm liking it. So maybe I should have changed the black top that she likes to wear because it's so small you can even see the lace. You can see it at the bottom, kind of. But yeah, this is my cute Moonlight kitchen witch. She's a kitchen witch. And yeah, so on to the next one. So this third one, some of you may know if you've been with my channel for a while. Most of you will not know, but this is Sharite. <laughs> Sharite is my first ever OC. And when I was drawing her look at that expression, she's like, mm hmm you forgot about me, didn't you? Mm -hmm. But Sharite is a kind of character where I, I have like mixed feelings. It's because I felt forced to create her in a way. But in doing this drawing, it made me realize about Charite and that I actually like her and that I don't have to force her story. Because that's what I've been doing. I forced her design, I forced her story. Because Charite was based off a drawing I did originally with a person with, you know, a, um, with a gem in the head. That was before I was watching Steven Universe, by the way. I think this encouraged me to watch Steven Universe. <laughs> and... I just redesigned her and I might have to draw Charite again on this channel because I think I finally got a color palette for her. So let's get on to the drawing. Okay lovelies, so here is Sharite and one thing I realized, she has so much details that it's really hard to get them all in one video, <laughs> in, in one video, in this tiny, tiny card. So with Sharite, let's zoom out a little. So here are the three of them, so uh, let's zoom back in. 
Muslim desert. So here are the three of them in all their finished glory. So in the beginning I was talking about I probably cut up into it. I was talking about having a circle in the back of them and stuff, but I realized the character is the main focus. Oh, it's going to rain. Close it up. That my character, my OCs are the main attraction, and that putting too much things in the background is going to be really distracting. So that's why I kept it simple and I kept like a border. I did it wrong with Swan. She's supposed to be behind this border and like popping out on the top but I did it with Moonlight and Shari as you can see and yeah I'm really really happy with this and also I noticed a theme purple 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 <laughs> I know purple is my favorite color but I didn't really realize until I put all three of them together that <laughs> All my OCs have purple hair. Okay, so if I ever, because I'm not forcing any OCs anymore, they will come naturally with time or when I feel like it. And yeah, I'm really happy. This is really fun to do. And fun fact the colors in the background is their Hogwarts house Swan's a Ravenclaw, Moonlight's a Hufflepuff, and Charad is a Slytherin. So I need a Gryffindor. I don't I don't need other OC yet. But this is my OCs. They look so cute as cards. So be like, hey, got some cards. Small moonlight. Uh, okay, this is cool. This is cool. It was really challenging for me because I like to draw big to like you know this, but this this was really cool. And I think I want to like design a, a pattern in the back for like to keep it cohesive. But I like it. The simple border and this one's ribbon on the side that i like it. it it ties everything together so i hope you guys enjoyed this video because i had a lot of fun rediscovering at least charites <laughs> and yeah it was really really cool i missed something on charite she has like glue like a white tattoo on her shoulder it's a circle i don't want to use the Posca pen because of it. But anyhow. Yeah. yeah. Alright. That that's alright. So yeah, this is the end of my video, lovelies. I hope you enjoy it and I hope you try it too with your OCs. And I'll see you in the next video, guys. Bye. member of Team Lovely and support me over on Patreon and I would like to thank Carla Finlow and YK so much for supporting me. Hey!